Whenever one thinks of the four seasons within the realm of artistic expression, Antonio Vivaldi's violin concertis immediately come to mind. The journey through spring, summer, fall, and winter has proven to be a great source for many artists throughout history, as it parallels the natural cycle of life. French artist Camille Delpy, a student of Barbizon masters Corot and Daubigny, was also drawn to the subject himself. In these four vertical canvases, Delpy aligns the fervor of each season with a set of characters on their various paths through life. Spring captures a young boy and a girl in a lush, vibrant field by the river. The newness of life is expressed in the light, soft colors. The boy lies casually in the background, summoning his confidence while the girl coquettishly turns away from him with her freshly picked flowers. There is a clear feeling of naivete and early romance. There is a warmth of optimism, and their journey ahead is just a dream away, perfectly depicted in the town on the horizon. Summer now brings us into this progression of early courtship, showing us how the couple have blossomed into adulthood and have fallen deeply in love. They stroll through the golden fields arm in arm with the hot afternoon sky illuminating an open terrain. Life is theirs to be had, and the fertile brown earth immediately before them lays a foundation for what is to come. Fall, the product of their love. The couple now have a child and have ripened into middle age. The artist uses a similar composition to spring, choosing to bring them back to the edge of a river with a steeper embankment and tall, towering autumnal trees that overshadow their journey as the man navigates the boat while the woman tends to their child, perhaps representing the struggles and toil of life. The town in the background, unlike the alluring and mysterious invitation that Spring offered, now looms with ambiguity and has lost any previous romanticism that once may have caught the couple's eye. Winter sets down the gravitas of old age. The place where this couple first came together is barely recognizable. The season's hardest bite of wind and snow surrounds the lone old man as he traverses the long barren road, still working but feeling the strains of life, symbolized by the pile of heavy sticks that he carries on his back. He is isolated and without his love, perhaps his way home to her. Delphi leaves us beautifully alone with our own imagination to ponder such conclusions. The youthful sky is far behind in this wisp of a waning sunset, and all one feels is the cold approaching stroke of death as it flies towards him in a flock of black crows.